Greetings, this is August 6. These are the infrared updates from the NASA firm system for the August 6, 12.30 a.m. White Rock Lake fire. Here is yesterday's infrared and now today's. The infrared has expanded over top of Monte Lake across Highway 97 and appears from this scale to be approximately 6 kilometers northeast of Highway 97. Movement on the southeastern flank appears to be within 2 kilometers from Okanagan Lake. We've zoomed into the area over Westwold. Here is the infrared from yesterday and now today. I'm not seeing expansion eastward along Highway 97 uh, towards Westwold, but I am seeing definite infrared uh, moving north of Highway 97. Please keep in mind that these heat detections or hot spots can be off position. They can be obscured by smoke and cloud. Also, not the entire square is being consumed by fire. It just means that somewhere within the square, heat was detected. We've now moved down to the southeast flank of this fire. This is west of Okanagan Lake. We're looking at the infrared from yesterday and now today. From the scale on the lower left hand portion of the screen, I'm gauging approximately one and a half to two kilometers to the lake shore. Those orange modus squares are approximately 750 meters, so about two kilometers. For a more detailed description and topographical measurement, there is the Canadian Wildland Fire Information System link in the description below. Just set the date to August 6th and uh, look at the M3 hotspots. I'll be doing that later. Uh, in the meantime, there has been dramatic movement here. Uh, moving both eastwards towards Okanagan Lake and northeastwards over Highway 97 over Monte Lake and now is in the forested blocks north of Highway 97. Um, I'll have to come back and uh, just kind of digest what I'm seeing here on the screen and look for uh, multiple sources to verify where this infrared is. Uh, thank you very much for watching, and uh, I will definitely be checking back and uh, seeing what uh, is happening in this fire zone. Please check with the links be below BC Wildfire and uh, get an up-to-date ground report. Be safe out there. Keep your nose to the breeze.